So in fact, it's a coalition of the willing. It's uh, those people involved in clinical research and research who wanted to bring their expertise together and make sure that by working together, they synergize and they do better collaborative work for quick response to guide policy for the COVID management. So the goal is really to share what we are doing, what is needed to have the capacity of, for example, a team asking for advice to another team that's developed some tools that could be useful for a clinical trial, to get access to <clears throat> expertise, for example, in how do you manage the ethical aspects of, um, of, uh, of research on COVID-19. So the situation is very dependent on the health system you operate in. So you have to you have to adjust to the health system. And then there might be some other more physiological differences, some comorbidities that you need to check. For example, there's a high burden of tuberculosis or HIV. How do the existing uh, treatment options that have been studied in one region of the world, how do they match and, and, and work with the other um, uh, populations? All of this has to be discussed. Say, for example, we have a clinical study that's looking at prophylaxis for frontline healthcare workers, which is a very important question. You're sitting in a country, you have a clinical site, you would like to participate to this study, and also your hospital would like to respond and have a quick answer of how, you know, um, how they can protect their own, their own health staff. So they might want to be included in that study. You don't have to start from rewriting everything. You can benefit from something that's already written, validated, and then adjusted to your specific needs.